In related news, President Trump threatened Monday to create obstacles for entry for asylum seekers from hurricane-ravaged Bahamas. But we have to be very careful. Everybody needs totally proper documentation because, the look, the, the uh, Bahamas had some tremendous problems with people going to the Bahamas that weren't supposed to be there. I don't want to allow people that weren't supposed to be in the Bahamas to come in to the United States, including some very bad people and some very bad gang members and some very, very bad drug dealers. Trump's comments contradict those of Acting Commissioner of Customs and Border Protection Mark Morgan, who said just hours earlier the agency was already processing entrants without documentation. This is a humanitarian mission, right, Morgan said to reporters. The death toll in the Bahamas has reached at least 50 people, though expected to soar as thousands are still missing. An estimated 5,000 people have fled the Bahamas since the devastating hurricane. On Sunday, over 100 people seeking asylum in the U.S. were turned away after boarding a ferry bound for Florida. The ferry operator has since apologized for kicking the passengers off the boat.